So one of the myths that's out there is that older adults actually need less sleep than middle-aged adults or young adults. Um, it turns out not to be true. It actually is a myth. Older adults need just as much sleep as they do in their 70s as they did when they were in their 40s. The problem is that it's simply older adults cannot generate the sleep that they still necessarily need. So the analogy would be like saying, well, older adults have weaker bones as they get older, and therefore older adults just need less strong bones. And that's not true. We accept that it's a problem and we treat it with supplements such as calcium. We need to do the same thing and have the same mentality approach when it comes to older adult sleep. We need to help them with their sleep, think about strategic ways to improve their sleep because they still need that sleep. And in fact, we know that sleep is one of the most uh, protective lifestyle factors that determines your dementia and Alzheimer's disease risk as well. So for all of these reasons, we need to let go of the, uh, the myth, and it truly is a myth, that older adults simply need less sleep. They don't, they need just as much sleep, they just can't physically generate it as the brain starts to deteriorate. So we need to find ways to supplement it. So how could we actually supplement the sleep of older adults? Well, one thing that we're developing at my sleep center at the University of California, Berkeley, is something called direct current brain stimulation. Now, it sounds like the stuff of science fiction. It's actually science fact. You apply some electrode pads to the head and you insert a small amount of voltage into the brain. So small that you typically don't feel it, but it has a measurable impact. And what we're trying to do is essentially sing in time with those deep sleep brain waves that are diminished in aging, almost like a, a choir to a flagging lead vocalist. And by amplifying the size of those deep sleep brain waves, we hope to try and salvage aspects of learning and memory function that sleep supports in older adults and those with dementia. That's one of my real hopes now, and uh, it's one of the moonshot goals that we have.